This is my 1973 Bay Window Volkswagen bus that I converted to an electric vehicle. Uh, and this is a five minute show to tell you a little bit about it. I hope you enjoy. Thanks for watching. There's my bus. It's orange, my favorite color. It was the emergency brake under the first wheel. Okay, look what happens when you open the engine compartment. There's some batteries and some angle iron. Underneath on that wood, under the wood, you can see the engine. Okay. Closer look. There's the engine and the cables connecting to the batteries. There's the original transmission. You can see uh, the controller. When you open the back hatch, there's a piece of wood that's covering the main battery pack. Got 14 batteries back here and the auxiliary battery. So there's 10 here. Those white things are just PVC pipe to keep the batteries from bouncing up. There's the shunt and the contactor. And the drop. And that big white line is a return spring. And I've got four batteries in the gas compartment. More gas tank. And if you look way back there, you can see the 12 volt deep cycle auxiliary battery. Need that for the radio and the lights. This is my favorite part the gas tank and the gas door. I've got my chargers, the big ones for the 220 for the main battery pack, and the little ones for the auxiliary battery. The sliding door. I've got 10 more batteries inside this box, which is right behind the driver's seat. And there's an exhaust port to vent out any gases that occur during charging. You get some hydrogen gas, which would be explosive. I've got enough room in the back seat for three car seats. Here's the outside vent from the battery pack. You can see I have some work to do on my driver's seat still, but I, I did reupholster the passenger seat someday. This is my amp meter and my volt meter and my emergency shutoff. It's right behind, right between the driver's seat and the passenger seat. I'm not using a clutch. So I'm going to shift. Underneath the front, I'm working on using this electric pump to add vacuum to help with the vacuum assist brakes. Okay, here it is. Here's the sound of it starting up. And that's it. It's on. Using a voltmeter, you can read the battery pack voltage, 155 volts. Each battery is about 6.3 volts, uh, a little higher than the 6 volt rating that they have. And the voltmeter is basically like your gas gauge. When the volts get too low, you know you got to recharge. The old radio still works. Delegates, uh, after Kentucky and Oregon tonight, and I'm sure he will, but Hillary is very busy, uh, you know, saying that. You don't have to, but I always wear these when I'm going in to touch the batteries. And here are the 10 batteries from the middle pack. And those white things are just PVC pipe to keep the batteries from bouncing up and down. Here's a close-up of the battery terminals I used. Okay, okay. You hear a little whine from the battery there. It's pretty quiet. People keep walking out in front of me. I'm speaking with you in one of the shops. That's about it for now. Um, 
if you want some more info, go to my blog at electricbus.blogspot.com. Bye-bye.